Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up an integration to transfer new leads from Google Lead Form to Google Sheets. This is necessary to automatically transfer new leads from Google Lead Form to other systems. For example, in Google Sheets you can add new rows and interact with them later. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next you need to select the data source system, Google Lead Form. Next, select an action. Get leads, new. At this stage, you need to create a virtual Google Lead Form account in the Apex Drive system. In this window we can give it a name or just click continue. When the connected account appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click continue. Now you see the URL for receiving data it is to this URL that new data from the Google Lead Form will be sent. In order to continue setting up, copy the URL and go to your Google Ads personal account. Next, go to the Ads Assets section. Assets section and select Lead Form. Now we need to select the lead form from which we want to receive new leads and go to its settings. We find in the item other data integration options. Paste the copied URL. Copy part of the URL and paste it into the key field. After this, you need to send test data to the specified URL. To do this, click Send Test Data. After successful submission, click Save and return to the Apex Drive system. At this stage you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so click Continue. At this point, you can see the test data we just sent to the specified URL. If you are happy with everything, click Continue. This completes the Google Lead Form data source setup successfully. Now you need to go to the Data Destination setting. Choose the system, Google Sheets. Next you need to select an action. Add Row. At this stage you need to connect your Google Sheets account to the Apex Drive system. In this window you need to specify the login and password of your Google account. At this stage, be sure to check all the access boxes. When the connected login appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this stage you need to select the file and sheet to which new lines will be added with each new lead from Google Lead Form. Now you see Google Sheets columns to which you can assign variables from Google Lead Form. In order to do this, click in the field and select a variable from the drop-down list. Please note that you can use not only variables from the drop-down list, but also enter data manually. When all the required columns are filled, click Continue. At this point, you see an example of the data that will be transferred to Google Sheets as new rows for each new lead from the Google Lead Form. If you are not satisfied with something, click Edit and you will go back a step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Google Sheets. After successful submission, go to Google Sheets and check the result. 
If you are satisfied with everything, return to the Apex Drive system and continue setting up. This completes the setup of Google Sheets as a data destination. Now you need to enable auto update and select an update interval, for example, once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.